Problems in relationships begin most when one partner stops trusting the other. So it happened in this seemingly happy-looking family. Joshua and Melanie had been married for two years, but they had no children. Everything in their lives was good until Melanie became pregnant and told her husband that they were going to be parents. She was so excited about this miracle that she didn't immediately notice how her husband had turned gloomy. Do you want to pin another man's baby on me? He said with hatred in his voice. If you got pregnant from an unknown man, then raise him yourself. Melanie was numb with horror. It was the first time she had ever seen Joshua behave like that. And his accusations of infidelity were so ridiculous that it didn't settle in her mind. She had never even dared to think of another man in her mind. And she had never given any reason for suspicion. How can you say such things about me? resented Melanie. I thought you'd be happy about this news, but instead you're throwing mud at me. Stop playing the innocent, laughed Joshua nervously. I'm not as stupid as you think. Let me explain. I was tested ten years ago, and I know that I'm infertile. Melanie felt sick, but she found strength and made one more attempt to talk sense into her spouse. She suggested that the doctors might have been wrong, because it often happens, but Joshua wouldn't listen to anything. No more fairy tales. Pack your things and get out, he shouted angrily, and Melanie had no choice but to leave her husband's apartment. On the one hand, Melanie was hurt and offended, and on the other hand, she was grateful that she realized in time what Joshua really was. Five years had passed. Joshua lived alone, having failed to settle his personal life. He did not trust anyone, especially women, and therefore his relationship with them did not last longer than two months. He never remembered his ex-wife and her child. For Melanie, on the contrary, everything worked out well. After going through a sea of accusations, scandals, and enduring a painful divorce, she went to live with her parents. But when her daughter was born, Melanie felt incredibly happy and realized that she would do anything for this baby girl. After a while, she found a good job and was able to take out a mortgage. Then a man came into her life who truly loved her and her daughter. One day, Joshua wandered through the park and saw his ex-wife holding the hand of a beautiful little girl with cute curls. The little girl looked so much like Joshua's sister in childhood that everything inside the man felt cold. For the first time, the thought dawned on him that perhaps he had been wrong all this time. He approached Melanie and tried to start a conversation, but she only walked past silently. He did not insist, but the very next day, after getting the address from Melanie's mother, he showed up on her doorstep with flowers. Melanie became curious about what her ex-husband would surprise her with this time, and she asked why he had come. As it turned out, Joshua decided to do a paternity test and came to get the material for the study. You can't have children, you said it yourself, so goodbye and don't ever show up here again, replied Melanie with a shake of her head. If this is my daughter, then I have the right, began Joshua, but Melanie did not let him finish and closed the door in front of him. Trust between people is a significant thing on which to build a healthy relationship. If there is no mutual trust in a couple, a happy marriage is out of the question. It is good that Melanie learned her husband's true nature in time, otherwise her future life would not have been happy.